we covered a lot of ground of establishing who these guys were in the first one, so we were able to really uh, dig down much deeper into who they are when they're relaxed, you know, when they're familiar with each other. That's when people really start to sparkle, and um, they let down their guards. They're vulnerable. A lot of it is, is I think, just his feeling of well-being within the group. You know, he's never quite felt so at home and part of a group before, and I think he really buys the idea that he has, like, made a, a leap. And um, especially the work that is happening with, with, with him and um, Black Widow and this sort of taming of Hulk and and being able to use her as a partner in this, you know, I think they're experimenting with how they, how the Hulk, how they control them, how they, and, uh, but I think mostly it's his just, he's in a great place in his life, and because of that, he feels more uh, able to join the world. With Joss, it starts with the writing. And the fact that each character sort of has their moment uh, is a tip of the hat to him because the story that he is telling, he knows it so well. And at the same time, he knows the character so well that he knows when those two things should and must intersect so that you get the perfect balance of character. You feel like you're being satisfied about who these people are, while at the same time pushing the story forward. I just think it's gonna be a great ride. Um, it, it just takes you to a lot of places, and, and, and each one of them is kind of visually pleasing uh, and emotionally pleasing. Uh, but together, they're epic.